Hey guys, a video for our nature and environment in Japan playlist. We made a video recently telling you guys about all the lady beetles, all the ladybirds, ladybugs, whatever you want to call them, that we've been seeing around the place. And we said there'd been a lot of them. Since then, there's even more. So all those little black things that you're seeing there are little larva, little lady beetle larva. They're completed lady beetles, obviously. More easy to recognize, but the black ones are little larva. So the cycle, we'd never seen them before. Usually we'll see maybe one lady beetle completed one like that one. That's usually what we'll see, just the occasional one of those in the garden. But all those little black ones are the larva, and then we're seeing the whole cycle. We're seeing these these little pupa, little yellow pupa, and the larva, and then the completed lady, <laughs> completed, the, the, finished, the finished lady beetle, the complete lady beetle. But just thousands and thousands of them. So this video is a bit of an a bit of an attempt to try and show you exactly how many of them we're seeing. And it's not just around our house either, it's everywhere we go around town we're seeing the same thing. It seems they like warm places. We'll see them on concrete walls and on rocks. I see those little black spots, all of those are lady beetles. Just unbelievable. And just walking around the house, you, some of you might have seen a video recently of, of the unskilled labourer painting in overalls. And you look down and they'll be on you. They just sort of fly, fly up and land on you. This grassy area here is just alive. That's actually the neighbour's place there. That's alive with them everywhere. So we've been calling them a plague, but... Plague is sort of a good word for, for lots of rats or locusts or some sort of bad thing. So a plague of lady beetles doesn't sound right, does it? It's more like an abundance. <laughs> we have an abundance of lady beetles. So right around the house, we're basically just walking right around the house here, showing you that every wall around the house has lady beetles on it. And the garden too, and the grass too, and the trees too. That's our, our cherry blossom tree. Some of you have been keeping track of this cherry blossom tree. And apparently lady beetles eat aethis and things like that. So they're a good thing to have on your cherry blossom tree. They won't eat the leaves. They'll just eat the things that eat the leaves. So happy to see them there. So they're a good thing. We are talking about this today. We decided that there's nothing bad about them. There's nothing that they do. They don't eat your trees, they don't do anything that you don't want them to. So they're a good thing to have around, but just look how many there is. It's just amazing. So you can see in one sort of small area how many there are, and then you look at how big this, this is the neighbor's place, right out of control garden. He's not exactly an avid gardener as our neighbor. As you can see, <laughs> but it's just alive, just absolutely alive. Some of the dandelions there too, we made a video about recently. Look at that. <laughs> the most inoffensive thing to have a plague of, isn't it? <laughs> Anyway, never seen anything like it before. The old guy that owns this uh, jungle next door has lived there for a million years and he said he hadn't seen anything like it either. So no idea why this has happened, why it's happening, but it's all good. <laughs> anyway, there it was. More videos coming soon.